four steps to success. Uh, this is my uh, my brief uh, process to start an online business in any uh, path possible, in any business model. Four steps to success. Uh, it's uh, simple, but the, these steps are the usual steps that I make you when I create an online business, and also when I uh, teach in uh, teach clients and teach newbies uh, in online business. So we start with products, pick products or services na ibebenta po nyo. Uh, this is. The, a very important step in starting an online business. Ano ba ang produkto may ibebenta nyo? Ano ba ang hinahanap ng market, ng merkado? O anong hinahanap ng mga uh, pagbebentahan nyo? So, dun po nagsisimula. Usually, uh, maghahanap kayo ng trends based sa uh, tinatarget nyong market. So, kung uh, mga taga Fairview na na tao or yung uh, pagbebentahan nyo, ano ba yung usual na hinahanap nila? Ano yung tingin yung hindi pa nabebenta doon? Or ano yung kulang? Or ano yung kailangan nila? So, doon po magsimula. Uh, usually, ang ang choice ng products at servisyo na ibebenta ng business, hindi po nanggagaling sa may-ari ng business. So, kung ako po magtatayo ng business, hindi po manggagaling sa akin. Usually, ang clue ng isang entrepreneur ay galing sa kanyang uh, tatargetin na market or ito yung mga taong pagbe pagbebentahan niya ano ba yung kailangan nila so from that from, from that market doon po nagkakaroon ng clue ang isang entrepreneur second is uh, kapag alam niyo na po ang ibebenta niyo obviously kailangan niyo gumawa ng e-store electronic store uh, Kanina po, in-explain natin may apat na way, owned website or owned application, uh, outsourced application or website, social media, and then the last is marketplaces. Now, the advantage of having an owned website is that you can try uh, advertising in Google or you can try affiliate marketing via Lazada. Uh, kapag may online electronic store na kayo, um, you need to create your uh, creatives. Ito po yung mga picture, ito po yung mga uh, mga description, ito yung uh, mga video na ilalagay nyo sa electronic store. Uh, ang electronic store po kasi is a proxy ng physical uh, yung, yung paghawak. Kasi po, pag pupunta ang isang customer sa isang tindahan sa mall, for example, kaya po nilang hawakan yung produkto, kaya po nilang tignan. Uh, ang proxy lang po doon, pag online business, is the creatives or content. Ito po yung picture ng produkto or description ng serbisyo. Ano yung guarantee? Uh, kung may video pa, ano yung mga features? Lahat ng information sa produkto or servisyo ang ino-offer ng isang online business, kailangan kompleto. Mas kompleto, mas makakapag-decide ang isang taong bumili sa isang online business. And then lastly, need to create marketing. Uh, marketing in terms of Facebook, Google, uh, but the most, uh, we need to start uh, relationships in marketing. So, kailangan uh, mag-uumpisa sa family and friends, offer your business, and then create a trust. Kasi ang hindrance po ng mga Filipino sa pagbili online is the trust level. Mapapagkatiwalaan ba tong website na to or page na to? Kasi baka marami pong scammers nowadays and uh, you don't want to be branded as such. So, kailangan you create marketing campaigns that would create your trust. So, may guarantee ba kayo? Ano yung mga usual o murders? Meron bang, so, meron bang uh, social proof? Meaning, may testimonials ba? From kakilala? Parang ganyan. 
So uh, that's uh, the four the four basic steps in creating an online business. Um, you will create, or you will encounter problems, but uh, the the first principle is that you need to create trust. Kailangan may trust. Uh, ang customer sa online uh, business. Um, usually, kapag nagmamarketing, it's more on sa messenger, uh, and then ask for feedback, offer discounts, so that you would know your first group of customers. Uh, from there, magkakaroon kayo ng mga testimonials dyan, you would post that, and then uh, create loyal customers from that. The four steps of success is first you create uh, you, you you create a, a quick market research for uh, clues on what to sell or what to what services to offer to your clients or customers. And when you have that product and services, you directly create your e-store or your electronic store. After which, you would populate the electronic, electronic store via content creative such as graphics, articles, videos, uh, and descriptions of your products. And after that, immediately offer a uh, marketing campaign so that you can uh, push your products and services to the market you intend to sell to. Uh, and then you'll be operating an online business.